have you been diagnosed with high FSH levels? Are you trying to get pregnant? I'm going to walk you through an alternative remedy that will help you balance your FSH, increase ovulation and conceive naturally. Let's start with what FSH is and how it affects your ability to have a baby. FSH stands for follicle stimulating hormone. It's a hormone made in the pituitary gland and the pituitary gland is in the brain. It works with luteinizing hormone in ovulation and menstruation. When the pituitary gland releases FSH, the hormones reach the ovaries via the bloodstream and then signals the ovarian follicles to grow and develop. When the ovarian follicles grow to the required levels of maturation, it releases an ovum or egg for fertilization. The follicle will also release other chemicals and hormones of its own and these hormones then indicate to the pituitary gland to stop sending FSH. If the follicles are not responding to the FSH, then the pituitary gland sends more and more until the ovaries start to respond. This is the most common reason for high FSH levels and depending on your age, it can be classified as menopause or premature ovarian failure. The ovarian follicles can fail to respond for numerous reasons but the most common reason for mature women to experience high FSH levels is a lack of blood flow to the ovaries. I said earlier that FSH travels through the blood, so if the blood isn't reaching the ovaries then the ovarian follicles won't respond to the FSH. One of the most dangerous consequences of high FSH is poor egg quality as the follicles need hormones, oxygen and nutrients to develop normally. Trying to get pregnant when your eggs are not healthy increases the risk of miscarriage and birth defects. And this is why IVF and drugs that stimulate ovulation are not always beneficial for mature mothers. So what is the natural solution to high FSH levels and how can egg quality be improved? Acupressure massage can be used to balance the hormones to stimulate the flow of blood, nutrients and oxygen and hormones to the ovaries and to stimulate the flow of blood, nutrients, oxygen and hormones to the ovaries and help them to function normally again. Other ways to stimulate the flow of blood to the ovaries include gentle cardiovascular exercise such as brisk walking or fertility yoga which is excellent for supporting all of the reproductive organs. Body cleansing is good for getting rid of any chemicals remaining in the body that are affecting hormone levels or egg quality. Body cleansing can help you get rid of xenoestrogens which cause menstrual and ovulation disorders and affect the natural balance of hormones. You can also balance your hormones with fertile plants which is completely natural and organic and contains herbs scientifically proven to increase your chances of getting pregnant. You'll also need to reduce your intake of salty foods as salt causes dehydration and puts a lot of pressure on the kidneys. In Chinese medicine, the kidneys are responsible for hormone balance. Cutting down your intake of caffeinated drinks will also be gentle to the kidneys, as will be increasing your intake of water. Finally, eating a healthy diet consisting of organic foods is also very important for supplying your body with the nutrients needed for fertility. Unfortunately, it's virtually impossible to get 100% of the vitamins and minerals needed to stay healthy. So you'll need to take nutritional supplements. And the best type of supplements are made from extracts of real foods, as they're in a form that the body can easily digest and assimilate. I use Alka Greens Plus and Antioxy Plus with all of my clients and I get great results with them. Antioxy Plus is excellent for helping to improve egg quality as it protects the body from free radical damage and has anti-aging effects. I hope this information was helpful to you. I have some more video clips and articles on how to reduce high FSH levels and how to get pregnant quickly in your 40s or over. Um, you can visit my website www.maturemotherskit.com for more information on how to get pregnant at age 35 or above.